Vishakhapatnam has always been so beautiful with its beaches and hills. I have always wished it to modernize with time. When I left the city five years back, the municipal corporation's proposal for the first flyover was passed. I am now rushing from the airport to fly high over it, to see my city from a new height, from its first flyover. Hey, what's this? Oh my god, the flyover construction is not yet over? The Asalmata flyover and subway were proposed to ease the traffic at three major junctions situated within 1500 meters the Asalmata junction, RTC junction, and Sangam Sanra junction. This project was meant to benefit the public. It was proposed by the Greater Visakhapatnam Municipal Corporation in the year 2006. The construction, however, began in 2008. The project was reviewed and was extended to further half kilometers making its completion period around 20 months. But however, its delay proved to be a pain. Construction work was even stopped for quite a long time. It's too dangerous, that man pulling the trolley, isn't it? Even till today, the required workforce is not available for construction, which is also the cause for slowdown in the work. The traffic diversion failed due to reluctancy of the people to follow the longer routes for their destination nearby. The auto following that route, which is too risky for it to come down, and the people walking nearby. One can't even imagine the plight of the poor people whose livelihood depended on the business they did roadside. <laughs> People were initially very excited about the flyover, but since the time extended, they have lost hope. No compensation has been given to the businessmen who have been affected. Sala problems are looking at it, man, we have done all the things. It is all right. It is very good, it is very good, sir. And the problem is. The flyover is in the core of the city where lots of business activities take place. Apart from that, there are many colleges and schools that create a heavy rush during the peak hours. The delay in the issue of funds is also leading to raise the material cost which in turn is leading to demand for more money from the government. This, in totality, is dealing the construction. The elderly people and the newborns are really suffering a lot because of the heavy dust due to construction. Development. 
The people traveling on those paths are constantly under the pressure of reaching their destinations on time. Also, those who are struck in the long, time-taking traffic jams are facing health problems due to fatigue and pollution. No one till now is satisfied with the flyover. Everyone is waiting eagerly for its completion as they are in no condition to face more problems. Flyover Kosam Jala Ibandhunne last three and a half years in the traffic jam, customer parking problem on the A buses would be rude or rather next autos would be raro. Auto me record in the care and condi TSR complex LA and they were raro. Then Rao and the Akre traffic jam on the parking a flyover materials would be a good party on a other good lift chair lay though. Chinna road, one way road. चला ये बंद कस्टमर्स बोले माँ को 75 परसेंट कस्टमर पॉइंट है इकड़ा ओनली 25 परसेंट बिजनेस होना है तो नहीं शॉप साइड है मतलब ऐसी सारी इकड़ा नो बिजनेस है नहीं अलग होना है एप्रूव के तैयार होता है दिल्ली तो The people have a common complaint that GVMC did not have a clear understanding of the funding. The plan was good had it been scheduled properly. Let's hear. What the GVMC has to say about it? The reason uh, there are a lot of problems in that. Uh, of course, the main problem is the land acquisition problem. Also. Land acquisition from the private uh, property owners, uh, paying compensations, negotiations with them. We, we, we are not doing any comp and land acquisition procedures. We are just convincing them and we are just asking them to part the land with us. So this is being we are having a lot of meetings with them. So it's taking time. At the same time, site from the railway, central government agencies, railway properties, railway uh, land is to be given about 2-3 acres for uh, farming service roads. So that's why that is one of the other reasons uh, which is making delay. And uh, as, 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 as the shifting of utilities, water supply pipelines and uh, telephone cables, electrical heavy lines, mm -hmm. those are also taking lines. In fact, earlier there were overhead lines. Now we wanted to make it the two underground mm -hmm. things. So these are the things uh, which are making the project delay. In fact, we are delayed by about one one year now. Yes. We are not doing the work. 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 We are not ఈ కొస్ట్ నుండి ఆగస్ట్ వరకు బిజినెస్ ఏరియా ఉండేదండి ఇప్పుడు అట్ లీస్ట్ మాకు వాటర్ పైడ్ కావాలంటే మేము ఎక్కడెక్కడికో వెళ్ళి తెచ్చుకోవాల్సి వస్తుంది బిజినెస్ లోనే కాదు ప్రతి ఒక్కరికి ప్రతి ఒక్కటి ఇబ్బందికరంగా ఉంది ఇక్కడ మార్కెట్ పోయిందమ్మా దారిలు ఆక దారిలాక మార్కెట్ పోయింది చాలా బాధపడిపోతున్నాం 25 సంవత్సరాలు 30 సంవత్సరాలు తక్కువే మార్కెట్ ఎప్పుడు కావుతదని ఇంకా తెలియదు గడిగడి తవ్వుతున్నారు ఆస్తి తవ్వుతున్నారు ఆస్తి వరకు Next day, there is a lot of work. 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 If you have a lot of work, you can use the parking boats. You can use the electric car. You can use the electric car. You can use the complex area. Modernization means upgradation with time. But this policy is lagging behind. From a cobbler to dweller. Vegetable seller to restaurant owner. Students to elderly people. From housewives to to bus drivers, from auto drivers and petrol pump owners to traffic policemen. All have suffered a lot. But still they hope that the flyover might be completed soon and they would experience a great ride on the first flyover of Vishakapatna.